Hello and welcome back to Geek Feng Shui. I'm your host and game master, Bob Sellers JR. In today's video, we're going to continue our Odyssey adventure. First, a shout out as usual to the Chaotic Good Brewing Company here in town. The great people, great place. I'm not reimbursed in any way, shape, or form for shouting them out or suggesting you check out breweries of similar state chore or however you want to pronounce it. Fun and games for the family, events. Dungeons and Dragons, uh, Magic the Gathering, Trivia, all kinds of fun things. Check them out. Check out those in your area. So today we're going to go back to Odyssey. Kind of uh, pick up where we left off. I get Pepsi, but you know all the gamers. Diablo 4 is just around the corner. I'll be playing some more Diablo 3 and others here coming up. As you're just getting these out of the way to get the ball rolling so I can randomly go through different games and play them. Both Odyssey and Origins do have a soundtrack you can get in iTunes or I'm sure you can get it off of Amazon as well. Great music to listen to. Everything about these games is well done. It's just that sometimes the people that prefer the canon of the story don't appreciate the work in games just because it doesn't meet with the expectations that they have set. It's unfortunate, but it happens. It's like I didn't get drawn in until Odyssey. Back and play Origin some. Now I've gone back in the older ones just to see what they were like. And Ubisoft over the years has gone through a lot of twisting and turning, unfortunately. My high school mascot was Spartans. So we will continue. I have not really saved a lot of different games with Odysseys I have at Valhalla. So it's kind of fun to go back. There's an excuse for this to play again. Assassins throughout culture and time periods of different. I think that's kind of draws people back from disliking one form of assassin versus another. I think it's kind of nice that they've come through. So now, the problem is you don't necessarily have leap of faith. So I'll show you what happens when you. Oh, she does. Okay. And uh, it's good to know. You don't learn it until a bit later in Valhalla. And we have one character, or one uh, ability. Do we have no ability points? We're level one. That's what that means. Careful. You don't jump 
fall and die. There's lots of quests and stuff that are going around and I'm trying to find. Fine, Phoebe. How much like Valhalla well, I have gear that I've pre purchased for other play sessions that will become available to this character. Doesn't mean they're your uber geared, it just means you get them at the level that you summon, yeah. so to speak. There they are. I'll sneak up on them, I like it. between the different games you sometimes forget. So we have photo mode is when you do the left and right bars there, so I try to avoid that. Um, pause menu, meditate, hold. Shoot arrow drop, shoot arrow, shoot these. So what I want is the vision. Thought it was. That falls a horse. Come on. I forget. That sounds silly, but maybe they. Free, free aim. Shoot, maybe I don't have to worry about it for a moment. So I thought there was a way. Oh, maybe there isn't. I'll worry about that later. Tighten those ropes. She'll make good ransom Drachmi for the Cyclops. No one's gonna buy me from you. They're all poor. Keep quiet, Phoebe. This tall grass will keep me hidden. Who did that? Hmm. 
What was that? That Marcos is going to be next. What? Get Phoebe out of here. Cassandra, I'm here. Untie me. Are you all right? It wasn't so bad. Last time they put a cloth in my mouth so I'd stop biting. Phoebe, just be careful. You're alone now since since my parents died. I'm okay. I've got you and. You've got me and Marcos. We're your family, right? <coughs> you have to be stronger than that. <laughs> Don't give in! Let him have it! <laughs> You. <laughs> Again, up. Yes, Father. Spartan rises as soon as they have fallen. Ready or stop? Widen your stance. A soldier grounds themselves. Good. Good. Spartans were the uh, fiercest warriors. Approach me. Ah! That's enough, Nikolaus. The sun's going down. Time to eat, don't you think? <laughs> what are we eating tonight? Tonight we are having baby Alexios. <laughs> and what a feast he will be. No! Him, take me instead. I'm tasty. Yes, yes, you're all sweet as honey. Now, come inside. The lamb's turning black. Here. Bake him in his bed. Yes, Pater. Cassandra. You are my greatest pride. Remember that. You will bring this family to glory. Go. Right. You worry too much. <laughs> You don't worry enough. We'll be all right if we watch out for each other. Which reminds me, the thug said you should watch your back. What'd they say? They said the Cyclops put a big bounty on you. Talos the Stonefist wants you dead. Talos the mercenary? Am I ever not in trouble? Mm. Better get him before he gets you. I hear he's really mean. I'll find my way back to town. Here! I lost the stone fist. That's just what I need today. Another broken nose. I'm going to have to take care of that. You are hunted, which means if there's a bounty, you'll see them. Tell us the stone fist. So let's that kind of reminds you of uh... Onward. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Let's 
Sammy, Bruce will be at his shop. Cassandra, good to see you. Cassandra, good to see you. Hello, Luris. Business looks good. Tell Marcos to come down here himself, if he wants his money. Huh? No, but I'm here now. Look, I was a little late paying. Now Marcos says I owe him double because of interest. I don't have it to spare. You should have thought of that when you borrowed Drachmi, Luis. But my family... It's hot. I'm in a bad mood. And you are going to pay. We both know it. Now the question is, what do I break first? You? Or your merchandise? You tell Marcos I've paid enough already. I won't bow to, to, to a mercenary or to someone foolish enough to borrow money from the Cyclops. From the Cyclops? That's how he bought his vineyard? Look, I know you'd be dead without Marcos. What with him taking you off the street as a kid. But you know what he's doing is crazy. Malaka. Still, that doesn't change the drachvi you owe. Face it. Once the Cyclops gets hold of you, you'll both be dead. I told you, I've paid Marcos enough. I told you, I've paid Marcos enough. Yeah. Hey, stop! That's my stuff! All right, all right. I'll pay you, just stop. Fine. The man is yours. Just leave. Pleasure doing business with you, Luris. Keep my name off your lips. I don't want the Cyclops coming after me for the debt and can't pay. Got a job to do, Cassandra? And yes, you can steal stuff and get in trouble. And there's quests that you can come up to do here. Pick up. You're running out of time until the Cyclops comes for you, Malaka. He wants his money. Could I have an extension? When he sails back to Kefalonia, he'll come and break you as soon as he docks, if you don't get it. Now, let's be civil. You can't hide behind your glories, Mistios forever, Marcos. He'll kill you, the mercenary, and that little runt girl that hangs around. Of course, not a problem. I'll get the drachmi. Good, or I'll come and watch the Cyclops feed you to his goats. Ah, Cassandra, I can tell from the smile on your face, Luris has paid you your drachmi. Who's smiling? I just heard where you got the drachmi for the vineyard. Are you out of your fucking mind? We can get the money back, <laughs> can't we? I'm sure it's possible. It will take a lot of work. And even then, I'm not sure. 
We have no option but to try. Then you'd better be willing to help. I won't do all the dirty work. <sighs> I long for the old days. Remember them? They were simple. You had nothing, young and alone, and I had everything. And I gave you the world, Kefalonia, in the palm of your hand. Alexios! Don't see fishes like you every day, huh? Eh? <laughs> oh! Ha! You hungry? How about we make a deal? I do something for you. You do a few things for me. Everybody wins. Best offer you're gonna get. Eh? Think about it. Wait. Today's society that would come across so badly. <laughs> Kefalonia. <laughs> Some gift. You were nothing without Marcos. And look how far we've come. From an orphan on the streets to a misthios with a havel. And now the Cyclops will take everything away. I can't protect you from him forever. He'll kill me too. Oh, don't be scared of him. And look at you! How could I go up against him? With what weapons? A rusty spear? A broken bow? There you are. Skulking around the temple won't save you from me, Marcos. Drusilla! I was just talking about you. You were? I need that wood, Marcos. These new bows will be the talk of the island. I can't make anything with those bandit malakes stopping the wood shipments. Of course you can't. Why, I was just filling my friend Cassandra in on the details. She already has a plan to deal with these bandits. She's the silent but deadly type. I don't care who does it, but someone better got those bandits. Today! A wonderful idea. I, for one, uh, need to rush home. Cassandra, I've cooked up a plan for our Cyclops dilemma. See me when you have time. <laughs> if you want your wood, you'll have to fix my broken bow first. Hmm. I usually only pay when the deed is done, but shit's moving at a snail's pace. Follow me. I love the uh, dialogue. These balls will make me rich as Chrysos. They're that good, are they? Wars brewing. The Athenians need good bows if they want to hold on the Spartans. Everybody benefits, I guess. Who are you? Marcos? You should be tired of this small-time shit. You'd make a fortune in this war. Plus, I hear you're a secret Spartan. That was a long time ago. I'm a Kefalonian. Hand it over. There you go, good as new. That bow is as strong as Heracles himself. Give it a try. Shoot your arrow at those dummies!
So this is when you have to go to your abilities. You now have one ability point. This is the revolution I was trying to find earlier. You don't have it till. Handy to have. There we go. So you can see things that you can steal and not get caught. So let's go look at our quests here. I'll bring them along. You have to find Tal. So what we're going to do is go over and get. Fair is fair. Are you going to get my wood? Those fucking bandits need a thrashing. Fair is fair. I'll fix your wood problem. Finally! Marco sure is lucky he's got you as his scapegoat. Mm. Any idea where these bandits are? I'm not a tracker, I'm a boyer. They're in the mountains somewhere, that much I know. I'd check close to the lumber camps. There's plenty of trees around. Why do you need this type of wood? I've been working on a new type of bow. It's more flexible, so it lasts longer and can fire at greater range. Only a very special kind of wood that grows high in the mountains will do. I'll take care of the bandits. Make sure that you do, and be quick about it. I'll deal with these bandits and get you the wood you need as fast as I can. Have patience. It won't take long. Ha! <laughs> if you knew how long Marcos has been feeding me excuses, you wouldn't be saying that. All right, I did something for you. Now you do something for me. Get my wood! So now you go through and try to find... We're going to do the lumbering along for first. Let's go look at the map. Oh, and there's also the guys trying to kill you, so there's that. Over time, you'll run into a lot of a lot of bounty hunters. You can see up ahead on this uh, helmet thing where this guy is. Here's where the ambush happened. I should look around. A 
cart was emptied, then left behind. The thief can't have gotten far with that much cargo. Kind of a like a sub. What? There is. Let's get this over with. Yep, and that's why you gotta have a better plan. <laughs> oh well, we loaded the latest save here. Yeah, it was worth a try. Bounty hunters as a rule are pretty tough. Are how long ago I've saved? So now you have manual save 19. It's a little different saving option than we have. Watching for me. I need to be careful. I'll gut you! For mine now! Here's the first chest. The treasure. The bow. So let's look at this bow. So we have a bow that's a serpent bow. We can compare.
One more chest. Other well, let's go look. He's a level five, so I don't think I want to. Find these other chests here. New treasure. How much you want to make a bet there in the tent? And that doofus is. You know, it's a hole in the back of the tent. So where? Get that other. There it is. Now we run. while they're chasing. Yeah. We're gonna circle around.
long as I stay away from him. That's a lot of footprints. A group left this area, headed west. What is west? Well, unfortunately, got a phone in here. shipyard. I need to sneak up on them. Yeah, I bet they do.
Let's find this other chest, shall we? Sometimes this is the hardest part. No, I could have used the bird to mark. Could have, should have. I got that. I want to make a bed he's up here. Oh yeah, these are things you can carry and Dump on them and shoot. So, down. Sometimes the bird will find what you look for. And right there is those clothes. The chests aren't necessarily as big as they always are. So we got that figured out. So we got this. Return to Drusilla. There's the check mark. I'm in the lumber ship there, so I can't call. Just gonna watch out for the stupid hunters. As you go along, the bounty will get bigger and bigger, and you can go pay off the bounties. Oh, look, 
Look, it's Marcus's mighty champion. <laughs> Don't tell me you actually did what I asked. I tracked the bandits and sent them to Addis. Your wound should arrive in town soon. And you expect me to believe the word of a mercenary? I didn't expect you to believe me, so I brought this. Here's your proof. A sample of the special wood you want so badly. These bows you're making had better be worthy of Apollo for all the trouble I've gone to. By the gods! You sure you work with Marcos? He's never once delivered on a promise. Incredible. I might work with him, but we're nothing alike. I'm true to my word. Then take your pay. Give none to Marcos. <gasps> Check out my books. Slashjr.com. Oh, we go up a level. Which means there's engravings that we can do instead of. So with abilities, we now have we have venomous attacks. Sparta kick is useful. You can kick somebody off the cliff. It's from the movie. I don't think that's a physical skill. So we're going to do a save. Now we have... A side thing with the leathers. And there's tons of these little... I wonder if we'll be able to leave without getting into a brawl. Oh my kidding. This place never changes. I should have known it was you who'd ask for the fur, Zillos. And I should have known it was you to get them for me. Cassandra's always on the job. Don't tell Marcos. Hmm. He'll get jealous. I posted publicly to give the others a chance. But you're always so keen. What are the pelts for this time? The Athenians want armor for the war. Good protection for them. Good drachmi for me. Here they are. All accounted for. In record time, too. Take your pay, it's well earned. Stay out of trouble, Lilos. You should take your own advice. How may I help you? Let's see, we're going to buy fourteen DPS equipped. You see the plus warrior damage versus plus hunter damage becomes important. be a true assassin. But again, an assassin damage. Uh, let's go out here. If I can help you again, let me know. So we have that.
Oh, Roman robe, I forgot. Didn't get that early. And you can look like the assassin. And so we can go with that. Let's see what we have here. Good to have those. We will save here. And now we look the part. Kind of did this to give people a saying, well, hey, it's, it's a good quest here. We'll talk to Marcos. As you can see, we have we'll go pick up other. Oh, Kefalus, I entreat you, send us a champion, someone worthy of your mighty spear. Help your priestess in her hour of need. You called? <gasps> oh, Cassandra, you startled me. Why are you looking for a champion? I need someone worthy to win the spear of Kefalus. I've been deciphering some of the sanctuary stone carvings. They say the spear was hidden in the caves beneath Kefalonia when the temple was built. You could get it for me, couldn't you? I can give you a reward. If the spear is in the caves, I'll find it. Well, maybe you were sent by Kefalus. Kefalus had a spear? Cassandra, surely you've heard this story since you were a child. I didn't have much time for stories. Well, perhaps you didn't. But you know Kefalus founded Kefalonia and started the line of Odysseus. His spear was a gift from the gods. It was said never to miss its target. He must have hidden it in the caves after killing his wife with it. He threw a spear that wouldn't miss at his wife? He was hunting and heard her in the bushes. He thought she was a deer. It's a sad story. Sounds dangerous. Well, only if you throw it at someone. Why do you need a spear? Not thinking of becoming a soldier, are you? Of course not. But think how many people will come to the shrine if we have the spear of Kefalus. With their donations, I could do so many things. Repair the sanctuary, feed the hungry families in Sami. So, where is this spear? Apparently, it's hidden deep in the caves beneath Kefalonia. There's an entrance north of here. Maybe you can try that way first. That's not much to go on. You have so little faith in the gods. If Kefalus means for us to have the spear, you will find it. I'll see what I can find. Oh, thank you. I'll prepare a spot in the sanctuary.
Well, let's go talk to Merkels first. The way they did it in um, Valhalla is you can a chess piece that you can use to make your outfit look like it says. Requests have for you to find different vegetation stuff for crafting. How'd it go with Marcos? How it always goes. I didn't get my money, and I'm running another errand for him. Why do you let him boss you around? I owe him a debt from the past. Oh, did you borrow Vrachmi? Not that kind of debt. Few people would take in a runaway they caught thieving. I was just a kid. Huh. I'm just a kid and I've done pretty good for myself. What do you want, Phoebe? You know Kausos? The town on the other side of the island? Why? People there are sick. And my friend Kina is too. There is a blood fever. They say it's a curse, and they need help from the gods. I told you, I'm not a god. But Icaros... ...is a bird. That doesn't mean you can't help. Ugh. All right. I'll look into it. Meanwhile... And not a moment too soon. I've dealt with the bandits and got in the wood for the voyeur. I had every confidence in you, my friend. Well, your plan? Right. The Cyclops and I have a score of drag me to settle. The same score as you, my rough and tumble friend. He wouldn't be after me if it wasn't for you, my friend. <laughs> hey, right. But I swear this will put an end to it. If he insists on sending his goons after us, we'll make sure his last good day was yesterday. Let's hear it then. What do I have to do? What will we do, you mean? As the brains to your brawn, I consider it a joint effort. <laughs> of course you do. Think, what does the Cyclops value most? His men? His land? His ships? No, his obsidian eye. Get to the point, Marcos. Oh, fine. We're going to steal it. Are you crazy? You borrow his drachmi, then you steal his eye? Having it means we win. Then it goes to market. We kill two birds with one obsidian eye. <laughs> He'd better hold still. Or he'll lose both eyes. No, no! It has to be done without the Cyclops knowing. You cannot be seen. Then my new bow will come in handy. He keeps the eye in his house. It's too valuable to wear out. A wise choice until you show him the error of his ways. Wait for the sun to set, sneak in, and then bring me the eye. Better be worth something. Do you know how much obsidian goes for in Kefalonia? I've never seen it. Exactly. And not only is it obsidian, it's veined with gold. Gold! It's no wonder he saves it for special occasions. So we'll use the profits to pay him off. It will pay for the bulk of it. A vineyard's expensive, you know. I don't know where the Cyclops lives. Keep to the west side of the island. There you will find his lair. Fine. But you won't get away with being cheap. Cheap? You wound me, Cassandra. 
It's your defining trait. Bring me the eye and I'll prove you wrong. Remember, not a soul can see you. Got it. Pull this off and our heads won't be the Cyclops' trophies when he comes back. Where well, we get this next quest? How to find the eye. If it's as valuable as Marco says, it'll be hidden. All these side quests are good for XP. You don't look so good. I angered them, I think. The gods. Murder or impiety? Neither. I used to worship Hermes at the Drogorati cave. There are gods there too, you know. In the cave? They grant wishes if you bring them tribute. So everyone makes an offering and asks for something in return. Ah, uh, no wishes of mine granted though. I'm running out of money and tribute. I'm poor myself, you know. I did something wrong. You know Hermes. He can be a trickster. Oh, but there are many gods in this cave. All asking for different things. Go hear them yourself. You'll get my last tribute if you do. I need to know if they're real. All right, don't worry. I'll go. Oh, thank you. Remember, be careful where you step, Mistyos. You'll be walking on holy ground. We'll see about that. So with that, oops. I think we're going to call it a video for the moment. And uh, just kind of wet your... And uh, we're going to quit out and uh, go on to other things. So check out uh, breweries in your area, such as our great one. Got a good brewing and uh, get back. Kind of loops around when you try to exit. There we go. So, have a good one. Stay safe. Subscribe. Set your bell accordingly. And I appreciate it as it helps the channel.